Fuck it. I'm not stupid, Murray. All right? I'm not an idiot. I wouldn't have done this if I hadn't considered every possible move you might make. What I would do if you did this or that. There's multiple scenarios playing out in my head. It's kind of like if we were locked in a game of crazy chess. I'd be ten moves ahead of you. Your king is trapped. My queen's breathing down his neck. My knight's running him down like a pig. And my bishop's bashing his fucking brains in all over the chessboard. And there's no way out. I didn't leave anything out. I didn't leave anything by chance. Nothing. Okay. We documented the whole thing from the beginning to the plan of evidence. Well, most of it you practically gift wrapped, actually. So, uh, I should thank you. You made things not only very easy, but you also kind of entertained it in a goofy, humbled Three Stooges kind of way. It's like, uh, I don't know, one of those in-flight movie on your way to your money. Where we'll be landing here in just a few minutes. And if you were to actually tell the truth, I mean... First of all, I'm not sure you even know what that is, the truth. But if you were to actually attempt to tell the truth, <laughs> you would sound like an unbelievably batshit crazy and no one would believe a single fucking word. No one. Your closest friend. Not even your mommy. So sign everything over to me. Everything. And I'll lock up all the evidence in some place safe and no one will ever see it. And you can live out the rest of your life in a antagonist ridden and tortured writer's existence and signing autographs and banging starstruck fans at conventions and um, who knows. I mean, maybe you could even write another book. Hmm. You know, like start over, new characters, new world, completely unwritten. Brand new adventure. That wouldn't be so bad. What? I mean, don't you kind of miss the old days? Be honest. Before you had it made. Back when everything was, I don't know, still an adventure. Don't you miss that? Just a little bit. 